The overall schema of a report is very important because without it, things don't work. If you've created a new reporting period like I've just done now, and you see this message, you'll know you have a problem. Students without an overall schema will not appear in printed reports or summary reports until this is corrected. So let's correct it. But first of all, what is it? Quite simply, it's everything that gets reported on that is not part of a subject. What those things are will depend on your school. Overall schemas are a setup process. Click on Academic Reports Setup and then Assessment Schemas. You can see why we got the error message. There are no overall schemas, which is why no students are assigned to them. Before we go any further, take note of this message on the right hand side. This provides some helpful guidance and it's worth pausing to read this carefully. Let's create a schema. Click on Create a new schema. The usual steps apply of creating a name and then filling in a few more details. Since this is a primary reporting period, let's make this one for stage three. Conceptually though, the same processes would apply for high school. Choose the type of default achievement scale. You can set what those scales mean later in the scale descriptions menu when you set up your report layout. The same goes for effort and attitudes to learning. Now let's select the default stage for adding outcomes to this schema. I'll make this stage three. Attributes are other things you may wish to report on. Again, that depends on your school. Then choose which comments you wish to include. Make the appropriate selections for your school's preferences. Then click Save and Continue. Now we need to assign assessment criteria for the schema. In this example, we'll select all of them. Click Save Assessment Criteria. The trail then stops and you might be wondering whether you've fixed the problem. Let's find out by going back out of the setup environment. No, the problem is still there. That's because we now need to assign classes to the schema. Navigate back to Academic Reports Setup and then click on Assessment Schemas again. You can see here that there are no classes assigned, which is why the problem still exists. Click Assign Classes. Since this is Stage 3, we'll select all the Years 5 and 6 classes. Click Save. Now let's go back out of Setup and see if that's made a difference. Ah, great! There are still students without an overall schema, but the number is much lower since all the Years 5 and 6 classes now have an overall schema applied. To get this number down to zero and remove the warning, we'd need to repeat this process by adding a schema to Early Stage 1 and Stages 1 and 2 as well. 